Today, a first alert weather alert day because monsoonal thunderstorms have still been present in Riverside County, though certainly not quite as active as what we were seeing this time yesterday, but still storms to our north, storms to our south, and we are still going to be seeing more clouds head over the Coachella Valley as we head throughout the rest of this evening. What I am keeping an eye on, though, is that little cell right there that's been working its way from San Diego County up towards the northeast very gradually, but really beginning to strengthen and right around the Santa Rosa Mountains. Certainly going to be keeping an eye on that because generally the flow is going to continue up towards the northeast. So should that continue to strengthen, I'll be watching that moving over the East Valley. Because of storms like this, where they can be quite isolated, where they're not going to be affecting everyone, but those that are under the thunderstorm certainly experience that heavy rain and the other impacts. Well, that's why a flood watch is in place. And if for a rather large area, I should say, for the local mountains, for uh, the Coachella Valley, for the high desert, and notice it goes up north towards San Bernardino County. It goes down south for Imperial and San Diego because these storms could develop anywhere. And that's basically what we're seeing out there today. The bulk of it right now, much farther up towards the north, uh, closer to Barstow, between Barstow and Vegas. I mean, even right now when we're looking at our dew point temperatures, they are lower than what they were this time yesterday. Yesterday, we were really looking at them in the 60s at times in the 70s. It was just incredibly sticky. Now 50s and 60s are out there, so still not dry, but a little bit drier than what we have been feeling. And we'll actually continue a subtle drying trend as we head into tomorrow. So for the rest of this evening, those temperatures cooling down nicely, close to 100 degrees around 8 p.m. Sunset for this evening is at 734. And yes, we are going to be having plenty of clouds overhead. So send your photos to share at KESQ.com. I'm also monitoring the air quality right now, moderate air quality around the Coachella Valley, but with a windblown dust advisory in place because of the thunderstorms around the desert, we have the potential for reduced air quality really for the rest of this week. Our Comfort Air 7 day forecast is showing plenty of clouds sticking with us through the week, but it's really as we head from Friday into Saturday, Sunday, Monday, that more moisture will be moving in, increasing our storm chances once again. The news continues after the break. You're watching News Channel 3, the desert's news leader.